bluegrass banjo. Things that will brighten the tone and sharpen the tone. And again, if you put all these factors together, you will probably increase your brightness, your volume, your clarity a little bit. Don't expect dramatic changes. Don't expect to take a $200 banjo and turn it into a pre-word gem. It won't happen. So, one thing obviously is your head needs to be fairly tight. So you can try tightening your head a little bit more than you normally would have it. It should brighten your tone a little bit. If you go too tight with the head, you will lose what you gained, or you run the risk of separating the flesh hoop from the head itself. Speaking of heads, if you have a skin head and you change to a plastic head or a mylar head, it's obviously going to get quite brighter. So if that change is in order, you can make that change. Uh, there is a, an in-between head that uh, is now called an elite it used to be called a uh, fiber skin, which is kind of a Weather King product, which is kind of a mix between the appearance of a skin head and some of the tonal qualities of a skin head, but also some of the brightness of a mylar head. That's in between the tone of a true skin and a true mylar head, and some people prefer that. They're, I think they're called elite today. So head tightness is one thing. Another thing will brighten the tone is your bridge. If the bridge is a little higher, if you make your bridge, uh, buy another bridge that's slightly higher, but if you do that you're going to change the action, which means you may have to change the neck angle and all that, that will tend to brighten your tone somewhat. And also the thickness of the bridge, as they're per made in production, they're a little thicker than most people prefer, so if you take the thickness of the bridge, allowing for the taper, and thin it down somewhat, that will brighten your tone a little bit. Now, you can always push the envelope too far in any of these things I'm going to tell you. You can make your head too tight, you'll lose what you gain. You can make your bridge too thin, you'll lose what you gain. Common sense must be employed. Another thing that will brighten your tone is if you have a tailpiece where you can adjust that angle, get the tailpiece to put more pressure on the strings, making a better contact with the feet of the bridge onto the head, so you can inertia the tailpiece down a little bit more. That will tend to brighten the tone. Um, string gauge. A medium gauge string will not give you as bright a tone as a thin gauge or a light gauge string will. Lights will usually give you that brighter tone. But when you put a medium string on, if you've had a light string on, it's going to change your action. So you may have to adjust your action when you go from light to medium. That has to do with the tension of the string. As the diameter gets greater in the strings, so does the tension in a lineal sense get greater. Therefore